Hello, this is Ed Thralls for International Wine Accessories, and I'm curious as to how many bottles of wine you have stored in boxes, under stairwells, and in bedroom closets throughout your house. You know, without proper storage conditions, you could be throwing away your money, or much worse, that bottled joy away. So today we talk with the nation's foremost expert on wine cellars, master wine cellar builder John Seitz, for some tips to consider about wine storage. My name is John Seitz, and I am the master wine cellar builder in the country. I travel around this country, and this luxury motor home which is just a, a great thing for me to do. I meet a lot of great people and uh, drink a lot of fine wines obviously. So I've been, I've been in this business for about 15 years, going on 16 years now. I started out uh, 15 years ago when a friend of mine said to me, hey listen can you build me a wine cellar? You know I always ask the customer the first thing, where do you want your wine cellar? You know at? wine likes a dark, moist place to so, sit. So now the question is do I need to get this lavish wine cellar and spend forty, fifty thousand dollars on these bottles of wine I only paid a hundred bucks for? My answer is no. I said, what are you looking to do? I said, are you looking to, to uh, you know, store wine for, for the long term? Are you looking for the short term? What are you looking for? The guy didn't have a clue. So then I kind of took him down the road of, of, you know, a chiller, a wine chiller versus a wine cellar. So the wine chiller, you can pick those up for three hundred to five hundred dollars depending on, on the sizes that you want you can bring them under a hundred dollars if you want to just store fifteen sixteen yes. bottles wine has become really nice for everybody and wine cellars were only enjoyed by those who had money big money and now but now we're trying to make it affordable for everybody yeah if you're if you're looking to to do a wine cellar don't just call your neighborhood guy and say hey well listen come over and, and build a wine cellar like my friend did with me I said, you know, he was, it, it was good and that was my start, but now, you know, this has been 15 years later and now we really need to get these, these rooms, we need to, they're temperature controlled, 55 degrees, 57 degrees on the temperature, 70% on the humidity, keep that cork moist in there, the long, you know, the long term storage, if you're looking for that, that's what you're looking at, and you're not looking to, to get the neighborhood handyman to come in and, and build something for you, get a qualified contractor to build your temperature controlled room because you're putting the most important thing in there that you own other than your children and your and your wife is your wine. So now you've got this great wine cellar that you've sent some money in and don't worry about filling it up yourself because your friends will definitely do it for you. Don't you. Wanna, you don't want to have too much light, you don't not, not enough noise, you don't want to have that room, that temperature go up and down and you can enjoy your wine for years to come.